We've been stuck in update 0.5 for way too long. When is 1.0 here? I got that info for you. And as well, I got a 40,000 gems an hour method. Let's check it out. So update 1.0 is the big talk right now. We have had absolute silence from the desk, but we finally have some news and some updates. So we got ourselves Scythe, a developer from Anime Vanguard, putting out an update regarding all these concerns. So he says a lot of people been complaining about the lack of communication, no schedule, etc. I'd like to clear up some concerns. So first off, why is there no release date for the update? A few months ago, we gave a release dates for May, June, then July. We never had any of these expected release dates, but we, so we want to be really careful and make sure that we can 100% make the date before we say anything, which usually means that we only give dates as updates when we're close to completion, like our 0 0.5 updates. I think you guys agree that waiting a little bit more is better than getting told the release date and then having to cancel it so what does this mean they are not close to replete to completing 1.0 the chance of them completing in 1.0 this week is probably very small next week probably still very small the only other thing that we have is that the boss event is here for five more days it could mean that they're dropping an update in five days but probably it's just that the boss event's going to go away or is extended which kind of sucks. Then he went on on, like, why don't they do sneak peeks? I'll just summarize it for you. Super simple. They just don't want to do it because people are going to have expectations from them, which they cannot meet. And that there's other games copying them. So if they give sneak peeks, then other games are going to finish it before them. Uh, and then they're going to have an update, which is like, you know, old, quote unquote. I get this because it's true. But on the other hand, I do think it's a bit of a communication slash development issue then because they're probably making hundreds of thousands to maybe even millions of dollars. You can hire some people that maybe work a bit faster. Uh, I know this is maybe like quite of a, ooh, that's, that's quite a big statement. You'll give them the time, get to do whatever. Um, but if other devs can do it faster, after you post sneak peek, you've already been probably completing it for 50, 60, 70% and they still can release it faster than you and maybe there's a, a little bit of an issue in that but you know regardless of that as well he gave a clarification that there will be no second half of update 0 0.5 update 1 will be a full feature update with new game mechanics that will affect every existing state chain unit update 0 0.5 was smaller in comparison so they do say that 1.0 will be very big i do understand that but i do believe and i always believe this thing i think giant updates are really bad for a game and they maybe are just doing the issue that they try to do too much in update 1.0. And I think people would rather have update 1.0 be cut in like four or five updates and have something every single week to play than waiting a month or two months for a update. Of course, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think about this. I personally way more prefer that way to have like small cut things every single week then one big update every two three months because that's just kind of boring that's everything we know about update 1.0 for now we just have to wait and otherwise probably move on to something else but for now i've done a lot of grinding you can see i have 141,000 gems i'll show you guys a method i've been doing for getting gems lately which is uh, very very nice but as well we can go to our evolve area because we have some units to evolve i've been grinding my booty off i got myself of course some materials so I want to evolve this, so we're gonna go ahead and do this and get ourselves Chan Evolution Blade Dancer Chan Mythic. Absolutely awesome. So let's go ahead and grab that up. Get ourselves some stat chips as well. And I think if I can, I will evolve Tangon as well. I need some of these. So I need 10 purple and two blue. 10 purple, two blue. So two blue. There we go. And 10 purple. Okay, do we have enough for Tangle now or are we missing the green? So it would kind of suck. Uh, no, we need four more greens. Okay, let's quickly get that. And that's two greens. And that's the last two that we need. Easy peasy. And we should get ourselves our Tangle and Fleshness Evolve. Beautiful. That's what we love to see. A nice we all Got an S on that. Beautiful. Uh, as well, I kind of butchered my... <laughs> my Sanji move. So, alright, there we go. Full A is not bad. So the method for gems that I was talking about is super simple, actually. It is all about Paragon. This is not a guide of how to get very super farm Paragon because I'm still experimenting with myself and there's probably some people out there that have already done hundreds of levels. But 
Paragon is the way to farm gems. So what you just do is you go to Planet Namek, you go to Paragon, and then you go, of course, to your highest level there is. And I would just go normal. You can see, every Paragon level you do, you get an extra 12 gems. So every level you can comfortably farm and set up a tiny task for means you can farm a bunch of gems. So normally, of course, if you'll be farming gems, you can get yourself 80 gems. But if you go ahead and do Paragon, you can see if I am farming level 9, for example, I already get double the amount as what I would normally be getting in the same amount of time. And what is awesome is this goes up to level 300. And that means that if you clear Paragon 300 with everything enabled, you will earn 3,680 gems per level every five minutes of course this requires a ridiculously good team good setup and a good knowledge about how the game works but that means yeah if you do five minutes per stage you can earn 44,160 gems an hour okay once you're in here you're looking for strong enemies this is actually bowed currently normally it's gonna make units stronger and stronger and stronger and stronger over the course of time but it doesn't do that which is absolutely awesome we're gonna go ahead and take regen as well strong enemies and you gotta keep taking the strong enemies one i will just get regen as well strong enemies it doesn't stack guys so which is absolutely awesome so we're gonna go get these regen we're gonna get strong 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 okay so Enemies are going to be a bit tougher, but they should be a lot tougher than they are. So it's a really buggy uh, modifier, which is very nice. And that's what makes this possible. So you can see, these units should be very strong. My Vegeta level 1 is one shot on these. They're only 260 HP. And this is Paragon 10. And of course, you can go higher and higher and higher and higher. But strong literally is bugged. It should not work this way. It should be a lot... Uh, the units should be way stronger than they currently are. Okay, wave 15 is here. All our Chines have level 5. So they get the triple blade slash. They should do more damage to bosses. And I am as well going to set them to strongest right now. Just to make sure that they always are attacking the boss. And what's nice is they can never be hit by the boss. Which is awesome. You can see... 188 gems and this keeps on going because you can of course go to the next wave paragon level 11 and we get another selection of a thing we take strong enemies because this one is bugged it doesn't give that there we have it guys that is the op gem method us talking about update 1.0 i really hope it's not going to take weeks or months until the update's out but i would love a little bit more transparency about this regardless like just for for everyone's sake so if you have enjoyed this video i would highly appreciate a like down below guys subscribe if you're new and i'll see you guys later today or tomorrow for another video so guys take care love bye thanks so much for watching and of course as well Take care.